Hey guys, Dan here with a quick comic book unboxing, and that is of the San Diego Comic Con Godzilla vs. Cthulhu one shot comic book. Um, this was like kind of like a crossover, I feel like people have been asking for it for years. So, um, obviously, I did not go to Comic Con, so this is a I had to pay the scalper price for it, but I don't think I did too bad. I think I only paid like 20 bucks over what it was retailing for. Let's see. Luckily it is a pretty thick issue and it's uh ties in with this Cthulhu Death May Die board game, type, tabletop game. Um, not super into the uh, tabletop. Not that I don't like it, but just I, I just don't have the time to play tabletop. So uh, I went with this cover. This is the one I ordered because I think it looks absolutely amazing. I love the head-to-head. -head. The art looks amazing. And yeah, we have the Godzilla vs. Cthulhu branding on it. Really nice, like, cardstock cover. And I don't want to go through too much on the issue here because I'm sure we're going to review this on the show. But yeah, really cool-looking art. You know, I don't want to go through too much. But uh, yeah, that's the issue. Some uh, more art on the back. Do they show the other cover? I do want to show you guys the other cover art. I think Frank actually got that one. Here's the uh, black and white pencils of the other cover. Yeah, really cool. Um, yeah, a crossover I've been waiting for. At least it's a pretty decently thick issue. So um, it is worth the one shot. I'm sure we will be reviewing this on the podcast eventually. But uh, yeah, just had to go you and show you guys this awesome issue. And um, tell us what you think of this. Um, is this something you guys were looking forward to or you guys just kind of met on it? I kind of like the whole Lovecraftian stuff. And, I, you know, I felt like this was a must buy for me. So uh, I'll read it, see how it is. But um, as of right now, just as a collectible, must buy.